an awful lot of our young people leave their dreams on other people's doorsteps because they've been told that it's so unpredictable in our industry, in our industry, in our industry. The big experiment, the flowering of the post-war dream. I grew up down in the valley of an idyllic tiny town with a history of hard work and prosperous farming. With the chains of high school forever broken, I became a bit of a star. I instantly jumped headlong into a huge animation arts project I envisioned. All children start out as artists of some capacity, and over time, they gradually leave it behind. Existing unseen without purpose in the shadow of the boomers. Generation X, an X for error across youth culture. It happens as you come to understand the real world. Vancouver, Vancouver, what have you become? You know, that's not, As you know, that's not media, right? I awoke with a lucid vision. It's already the greatest city on Earth. We'll change the world. This will be the model for the world. Grab my little video camera and hit the streets to make a documentary. artists in politics because artists get ideas about how things should be. Well, the most famous example was Hitler. The truth of Vancouver, Canada. No wonder to me now. Canada doesn't support its agricultural producers, we'll see agriculture die. Was that you, Heath? Whatever sounded really strange. I don't, I presume you're not home, otherwise you'd come to the phone by now. <laughs> 